Hello, welcome back. Um, be happy. So, yes. I'm going to... Um, 21 beh versions behind there. <laughs> yeah, great. Yeah, not what you're going to do about it, though. Oh, yeah, got a barrel in there. Um, yeah. Uh, mm -mm -mm. Sorry, where are my Eudorian bees in it? Yeah, I feel like I should I should try and comp compress these all around to DNA. I will get around to that soon. Ah, uh, yeah. So, I'm at 62% on this. Not enough says, not enough coal. Tin, tin, tin. So, look at the tin then. It's not enough either. All right. What I was going to do is I wanted to actually um, basically just uh, get all the different uh, trees and butterflies. Let's start on that properly. Um, oh yeah, I wouldn't mind getting the watering can. I've got it in my inventory actually. Uh, did I see? There were. I've got enough wood. Quite here. Yeah. And there's a tree over there. I've planted that ages ago. I can't believe it's only just grown actually. I think it was that. It looks like the same it looks like the same texture as lava in that moment it did. So if I mix together, like, uh, is it still called rose in this? No. <laughs> if I, if I, um, uh, I mean, well, you get, what options am I going to get for usages of this? So I can actually do shit. <laughs> can I put this down? Can I put these flowers in there? Oh my God. Let me just get a dandelion. I have actually got an analyzer. And I, I suppose, I mean, yeah, like. I hate when it doesn't work. <laughs> the search, it's annoying. Oh well. Is this gonna go in? Hmm. Yeah, I actually remember doing this in my botany video. The only way it will work is if I get the thing. If I get if I um get a trowel, that's it, isn't it? Not that there. Just a stick. That will convey over. And then I'll be able to do stuff with it. Let me just do that very briefly actually. So we'll see if this is actually going to convert it over correctly. I mean, I wonder if I can just do it randomly. Probably not. If I do, I really need to set up all the right conditions. I may need to. Nope. Okay. Hmm. Cool. Okay. So let's do, let's forget about butterflies for a moment. Let's just do trees and, yeah. Trees and the flowers. Uh, I'm not gonna, hmm, that tree actually grew. is broken. Uh, 
Hmm. I wonder if I should make a different colour of the... Uh, what did I want? Oh yeah, my pickaxe. Pickaxe. Right, so what colour kind of chest we have? Blue. Let's see if we get a different colour. And I've got. Do I have a green one? I've got a grey. I've got the two greys, I think. I've got the blue, blue, purpley, grey, orange. I've actually got two orange, haven't I? Know. Is that the same? This is a, this is a dark orange. Yeah, I've got that one and that one. I may not have both purples. Uh, I think I've got the green ones actually. At some point did I get cactus green? I wonder. Hmm. I don't know. Let's not bother with that for now. I'm not going to get too, too uh, invested with that particular issue. Uh, and what I'm going to do instead is just make a chest. Just be easy. And the way I'm going to see it, I think, is... Just do it over here, I think, because it's a decent view of the thing. And it's not in the way of this stuff. So, yeah. Ooh, a little crazy. Eh? Is this going to break it? No. I don't actually want to do it though, though. I do want to make them separate, but I do want to make them in front of this thing. So, like, if I if I wanted to, I could always move them straight in. Um, okay. So where'd my trail go? I've got it here. Let's do the flowers first, actually. I think I've already started them. Um, so I want to get all the different flowers, right? And and just to just to begin with, uh, I want to I want to do the whole lot in industry. Not really paying much attention to the uh, uh, yeah. I think it's poppy that I mixed together. I think so. And we'll, we'll just choose one of these chests. Um, all right. So we've got a few. Yeah, I mean, we've already got loads of resources anyway, so I may as well do it at this point. All right. So let's just grab, grab a couple from here then. Really, you're not stacking? Oh. Stand on this one. Done. Whatever. <laughs> Alright then. Let's, uh, let's grab a few more actually. I'm going to grab as many as I can find over here. Uh, tell me if I hadn't filled up my inventory. Uh, well, I'll get rid of this. Let's steal away from there. Alright, let's just get as many as I can of these basic flowers. So, this, this area is actually going to be very useful. Um, I knew it would be at some point. <laughs> But yeah, starting with the red and yellow mixing is, uh, is a good idea, I think. Uh, and obviously, these are the most common flowers uh, in the game. So we've just got a couple more here. I'm just going to botanize them. There we go. So five and seven, and let's see what we can mix them with. Okay, so uh, 
Uh, Orchid's probably a good one to get early on. Light blue. It's another recipe. I'm going to need to actually. I'm going to work more directly on the flowers at this point. Uh, yeah, let me just get rid of. See if I can get rid of anything. Anything else to go? Well, glass useless really. So it's wood to a certain extent. And just want to try to clear my inventory so I can have a load of flowers in here. Uh, yeah. And the next one beats. All right, let's do. A, let's just do a couple of mutations just for this uh, section there. So, poppy a geranium, probably with an iris. Probably with dandelions, gonna make a daffodil. Tulip will probably make a dianthus. Uh, yes. And probably with an orchid. So yeah, you can see here these things. So the highest percentage is orchid and poppy, and tulip and poppy. Uh, so dandelion poppy is less. We've probably got a nice. I wonder what the size of this menu is. Not very big. Hmm. I wonder if this is all, all in here. I'm just curious. I feel like this, it's not such a small menu. Maybe it is though. It's not that big, is it? There's only a certain amount of flowers. You can actually, uh, one, two, three, four, that's six, so 10, 16, 22, uh, 28. 34, 40, 6, huh, 50. There's not 50 here, are there? There's only 38. Well, could, could there be 50? That's an interesting question. There's a delphinium here, for instance. Yep. How about the, the diamonds we know already? An enemy. Let's just check the an enemy then. There we go. Aquilegia and Rouge. Okay. All right. Let's um. All right. Here's the way I'm going to do this. I think we're going to say let this is uh. I guess the way to the way to compare it in terms of bees. I would say this is a hive. This is a hive, right? This is a hive um. Uh, bee. So I mean, it's obviously not a hive bee, but in a sense it is because it's it's one which you can find directly in the world in the same way that you'd find the meadows bee in the, in the meadows hive in the world. So yeah, do I actually block that up? I did. All right. So hopefully, if anything, it doesn't look like anything's going on with this tree. <laughs> obviously, I know that if you plant some of these flowers in here, it might do stuff to it, but I'm not going to do that at the moment. Uh yeah. Okay, let's begin with, we've got enough diamonds now, and do I actually have a, well, yeah, I've got quite a lot actually in there. Uh, isn't there a flower visor or something? How do I scan the flowers? Is there no way for me to scan the fucking flowers? I guess there won't be, will there? Hmm. That is not good, though. Hmm. 
Yeah, this thing is used to actually right click on to get stats from the actual soil. So this is not actually what I want. I could probably do with this thing. This is one thing I could get, I suppose. So I need two, I need two and a bit gold. Uh, I think my gold is really low though. I actually might have enough. I need an emerald and a diamond. I've got emeralds, plenty of them. I've got diamonds. I think I can actually make it. Let's make it then. So what do I want? One emerald, one diamond, and 20 nuggets. Yeah, I need to get more gold. That's something which I'm really not doing well on. Uh, but I need... I basically need... another piece of gold. And I'll take out the remaining notes here. Right. Yep. And then there's a diamond... Uh, an emerald. Diamond... Oh, I've actually got it on me already. I was probably, I was probably going to make one of the other ones, but I just didn't. Uh, the redstone I might not have on me there. Yeah, there's some here. Alright, let's go to the carpet to make this thing. Just so I've actually got... Even though I haven't actually scanned the things, and I can't, I can't... For some reason I just can't remember exactly how to do that at the moment, but it's not going to take me long to work that one out. Uh, so yeah, just a pane of glass in here. And then we'll put the thingies here, these here, these here, and then emerald. Right now. Uh oh, what does it need? Water. That should be all right. Uh, oh yeah, right, a little carpenter. Fair enough? Pretty not. Doesn't look like it. Uh, is that not enough? There we go. So yeah, is that enough? Two thousand. It needs two thousand. Oh, there we go. All right. So yeah, like I said, we'll work out scanning, but it's not that important really. Uh, I still would like to scan them, to be honest. I mean, there must be something in here which is going to help me scan them. How do I get these blocks? I kind of want those blocks, they look really cool. Now, this is from extra trees, isn't it? Oh, look, I've made an extra tree. Look, I've done videos and all this stuff like before. So I kind of know why everything is the way it is. Wood. Woodworker, maybe? No, maybe it is this. Huh. Yeah, I will. I, I, I've got... The thing is, right, it, I may as well at least use some of the experience that I actually have with this stuff to... Um, uh, you know... So what's this going to tell me? Nothing. Hmm. Well, it does tell me something, I suppose. <laughs> I 
there's a lot of yellow green no white is, is resultants mauve basically the more complex sort of looking colors have got uh, yeah obviously you need, to, you need I need to do the, the scanning first for this let's make a woodworker anyway just need a couple of proven gears let's make three proven gears uh, oh we don't even have any of this the impregnated sticks just two blocks of wood in the carpenter Hmm. I think I used all my wood already now. Oh well. Well, we'll have that one there on the back burner, I guess. The tin. The tin's going to be ready in a few episodes, <laughs> basically, from the looks of it. Um, but yeah, so let's let's focus on the primary uh, task at hand then. Uh, I want to keep at least one of these. Uh, let's make a. Uh, yeah, let's just go through this process, and then I can do another sweep where I actually actually scan it. Uh, I will check that. Uh, uh, I'm just trying to remember why the fuck I can't actually check it. What is it? Flower lizer. Hmm. It may be one of these things. Look at the field counter. A lot of this is. Uh, what does it actually count in? It doesn't count in extra trees, does it? Mm, I didn't even realize we've got dormant energy distance. It's interesting. He said, "No, I know about the flat lines, though." But I feel like I would need to use the actual. Um, so that's four thir thirty four. I just want to check something. Forty three, thirty one. Just in the off chance they're actually in the same ID. It's just a huge jump, isn't there? Yeah, <laughs> in nowhere. Yeah, basically, it's not listed by ID from the looks of it. Mm, what have we got in here? Probably if I made the actual analyzer, it might be able to get it. But yeah, there's some. Um, all right, so what I'm going to do, I think, in the next episode, I'm going to I'm going to just make all the flowers, uh, and then probably in about <laughs> yeah, I mean, to give you some little and then about two or three episodes, I'm going to actually scan the flowers. Uh, probably should do the scan first, but meh, whatever. Uh, so we'll just uh, well, we'll see. Actually, maybe I'll just I might just actually look it up uh, before the next episode. And I think about it. All right, then. Till then, thanks for watching.